G'day everyone, it's Matt and welcome to, or welcome back, to Relive Adelaide. So what I thought we'd do, considering it's winter, is just blow away those winter blues and I'll show you how to get from the Adelaide Railway Station to the Adelaide Street Circuit. So once you get into the Adelaide Railway Station on the train, just one set of turnstiles to go through and then chuck a right and look at that beautiful building beautiful heritage building of the Adelaide Railway Station. Once you head down the concourse, you'll head up the escalators and you'll head onto North Terrace. Once you get onto North Terrace, if you want to, you can cross the road and catch the tram. We're not going to be doing that today. We're going to be going on foot because it's a lovely day for a walk. But if you want to, the tram is always available, which will head straight down North Terrace towards East Terrace and the Adelaide Street Circuit. So here we are. You can see the Adelaide train station there on the left. Down the background, here is Parliament House. And that is King William Road heading down there. And we'll be crossing the road, and to your right will be King William Street. So, green man's flashing, let's get across to the other side. So, we'll see in a moment is Government House. And also, in Adelaide, there are a lot of beautiful statues to look at. A lot of plaques signifying what they refer to, so keep your eye out. There is Government House and a lovely, beautiful statue right there in front of you. But what we'll do is we'll pan around, we'll look towards we'll look towards King William Street and we'll just head straight down there towards Rundle Mall. So at Rundle Mall, you'll see Haig's chocolates on one corner. Jump in there, <laughs> there's beautiful chocolates as well. But if chocolates aren't your fancy and you love a bit of nuts, so go across to the other side of the road and you'll see Charlesworth nuts. Grab something beautiful from there. So if you love your nuts, jump into Charlesworth nuts. As you're heading down Rundle Mall as well, you'll see a lot of beautiful sculpture. There will be the bronze pigs, which I didn't grab any uh, footage of. But there will also be this big, this massively big, ridiculous chrome pigeon. So grab a photo with that as well. Hashtag in yourself on Instagram. If anybody says to you, I'll meet you at the mall's balls, don't, don't get offended. It's okay. Meet you at the balls. There they are, the big chrome balls out the front of the Adelaide Central Plaza. They're great. Grab a picture, but we're going to get away from that. and We're going to head down Rundle Mall towards Rundle Street. So that's the continuation of Rundle Mall. At the end of Rundle Mall, we'll go over. There we are. And this becomes Rundle Street. So Rundle Street as well is a shopping district, but obviously traffic as well in the middle. So as our walk continues on, it's not too far to go, but if you need a coffee or you need a little bit of food or drink, this is the place to stop by, Rundle Street. At night time, the place absolutely comes alive, but if you still need uh, something to, to get you through that little walk, this is the place to get it. So as we get to the end of Rundle Street, it'll turn into Rundle Road. And those familiar with the Adelaide Street Circuit will notice that beautiful building. It's the Stag Hotel on the corner of East Terrace and Rundle Street. And if we look around here, as we're panning around, that turns into Rundle Road or the Jones Strait of the old Adelaide Street Circuit. So let's get across to the other side and we'll uh, head down towards the Adelaide 500 shortened version of the Adelaide Street Circuit. Now 
Now that we're on the other side of the road, as we pan across, you'll see the Stag Hotel there right in front of us now and the facade of the old Adelaide Fruit and Veg Markets. If you walk on the other side of the road and look behind there, there'll just be apartments and everything, but that facade is absolutely beautiful. So let's head down East Terrace towards the Adelaide 500 circuit. And now we come to the exciting bit. So the road's closed off. Rymel Park, you can see there if you want to stop off, grab a little bit of a picnic, fantastic. It's a beautiful place to sit, but we're going to continue down and head towards the entry point for the Adelaide 500. Look at that. A lot of people streaming in. You can see the ticket booth there on your left-hand side and the gate towards us. If you need to get to the Adelaide Street Circuit, obviously you can use Google Maps on your phone to guide your way, but I just hope that you've uh, enjoyed this experience of walking to the Adelaide Street Circuit from the Adelaide Railway Station. And I look forward to you joining me again on the next video or podcast for Relive Adelaide. Take care and bye for now.